Hi and welcome to Deluxe. We have two VW panel vans here. This white one is completely bog standard with no modifications and we have a green panel van that's been fully lined out with a Deluxe Pro sound deadening and insulation kit. The idea is to make three very simple and quick comparisons between the two to show you how our product will completely change the dynamics of your vehicle's bodywork and achieve an incredibly quiet driving experience for you. The first comparison is as simple as closing the sliding door and listening for the amount of noise it makes and the tone of noise in standard form. A bit on the loud side, not very nice. If we compare it to the green van, as you can hear, it's a completely different sound. It's a good solid clunk. In fact, it sounds just like a golf. Now this slider sounds so much more solid than the standard van because it actually is. The bodywork now is far more rigid now that it's been lined properly with the Deluxe Pro product. And when I say properly, I refer you to the pictures on the website. You'll see that any single skin area of bodywork on the van is completely covered. Not just patches, not just squares here and there. If you don't cover the whole panel, you can't control it. You can't stop it from flexing. And if you haven't stopped the flex, it will vibrate when you drive along. And that vibration is where all your noise comes from. So don't cut corners because you'll get really poor results. On top of that, the product that we actually use is the highest density, fit for purpose acoustic foam available. So it will outperform all other products. Please do your own comparing and researching, but that is a fact. So if we take a look at the top of this sliding door, that's a really large panel and that's single skin metal, about a millimetre and a half thick. And in a standard van, that would be really flimsy and there would be an awful lot of flex in it. But let's take a little look and a listen. If we hit it, it's nice and solid because it's a nice rigid panel there. Sounds nice and thick. Makes a hell of a difference when you do the job properly. Now I'm actually going to place my thumb right in the centre of this panel, its weakest point, and I'm going to push in and try and get it to flex. I want it to actually buckle, but it won't because it's really, really strong now. And I'm actually using my whole body weight right in the centre, its weakest point, and it's moving a tiny amount, about a mil or two at the most. And that's a tremendous difference from a standard van. If I now do the same on the standard van, I'll knock that top panel a few times so that you can hear how flimsy it sounds in comparison to the green van. And then I'll push my thumb in the centre of that panel again just to demonstrate how weak that panel actually is. It will buckle very easily. So first of all... As you can hear, very tinny and very flimsy and not very nice. And now if I put my thumb in that centre part of the panel, it is weakest spot. As you can see and hear, it buckles very easily. I don't have to use my body weight there because it really is quite weak. By all means, check on your own van. The problem with your commercial vehicles is that most of the bodywork is like that. It's very thin metal, and there's a tremendous amount of flex throughout the vehicle, um, which as I've said before, turns into vibration as you're driving along and generates an awful lot of sound. But quite simply, if you use the right product, hint, hint, and you do the job properly and thoroughly, you can get excellent results. Thanks for listening.